People talk a lot of shit behind a computer keyboard. I treated E.J. Manuel the same way I treated Nathan Peterman. E.J. Manuel was a rookie. He needed to make mistakes in order to learn. You don't, you don't have a perfect game your first outing. You're going to make mistakes because you're a rookie. Yes, Nathan Peterman threw five interceptions in his first start. He's a rookie. He's got to learn. E.J. Manuel threw four. Four in his first start ever against the New England Patriots. And still almost beat him. The Bills only lost 23-21. And E.J. threw three touchdowns in that game. And still, the Patriots couldn't blow us away. Because EJ was moving and moving and moving the Bills. I think he threw for like 224, 225 in that game. And EJ, er, Tyrod Taylor only threw for 56 against the Aints. <laughs> and people say, oh, you're a racist because, because you're, you're going with Nathan Peterman. No, I fought for EJ Manuel too. People talk a lot of shit behind a computer and they know nothing about me. <laughs> I find that fucking hilarious. I do. I find it hilarious. I fought almost 50,000 Bills fans for EJ Manuel. And nobody wanted to give him a chance. Well, in the end, he ended up not being a good QB. So I went to war for nothing. But Tyrod Taylor's a... a uh, uh, veteran, he shouldn't be fumbling the ball. He shouldn't be making these rookie mistakes, okay? And when he makes mistakes, I'm going to call him out on him. I'm going to call any Bills player out on him. Hell, thank God we have LaShawn McCoy because if it wasn't for him, fuck, we wouldn't get anywhere. Uh... So don't sit here and fucking say I'm this and I'm that when you don't have facts, when you know nothing about me. You like to talk shit behind the keyboard. <laughs> I find that hilarious. Anyway, if you like my videos, like and subscribe. Go Bills. Queef the Chiefs.